Hey everybody, so I'm taking a break from Transformers at the moment and we're gonna play a different DS game today. Also, I know I really need to shave. I've actually lost my razor, which is annoying. So please don't, please don't bully me. Don't like that very much. I'm really hoping this game today is good. Okay. I can get behind the menu theme. The menu theme is fucking sweet. Enter name. Uh, I'm, I don't know, should I put something funny or do I just put like my regular name? Yeah. Okay. Let's just put my normal name. I can't be bothered to put, <laughs> to put something funny. So there's a bunch of different options. Uh, I guess we'll just go story. Oh my God. <laughs> I feel violated. Don't touch me. Touch me. Stupid bitch. Ladies and gentle cowers, welcome back to Radiator Springs, where boy do we got a lot of busy and exciting stuff going on. Like what? Behind me is where Lightning McQueen, my best friend, is going to be building his new racing headquarters. That's pretty cool. And then even more better, we going to have our very own racing stadium. We'll see how that's coming along later. No way! But the most and bestest part of all is we got all these new folks coming from all over the world to race in our first annual Radiator Springs. Uh, what is it? Uh, in, in, uh, in, in, inter. I like Homeboy in the back. <laughs> He's my favorite character so far. We got real racing professionals visiting from Germany, Japan. Italy and all sorts of other places I've seen on TV. Okay. There's gonna be all sorts of cool happenings going on this week, races and games, and if we're lucky, a whole lot of crashing. So just stay. Tuned. Wait, no. <laughs> you you don't crash when you race. You don't crash when you race. How are you gonna build a racetrack and a racing headquarters in your hometown if you don't know that crashing is not a normal part of racing? You drip. What do you think you're doing? Absolute wet wipe. Okay, there's a bunch of. Wait, who the? Who is who's this? Why is he looking at me like that? Don't look at me like that. You freak, don't look at me like that. Look at him. He's giving me side eye. We haven't even we don't even know each other, bro. We we don't know each other. I got an itchy nose. I like the environment. Oh, who's this? Who's this? I don't know what these little cars popping up are for. Okay, there's this little Red Dead 2 saloon looking map, but we're gonna go with the main one for now. The main street rusties. I'm assuming this is gonna be like super e <laughs> Look at the character models! <laughs> I guess we should pick him though, right? Like it makes sense. It makes sense to pick him. Lightning Queen is quicker than quick. <laughs> it sounds nothing like Owen Wilson. Lightning McQueen is quicker than quick. You can't just have some American dude do Lightning McQueen's voice. That, that, that doesn't work. That's not. That's not. <laughs> Why, man? Okay, whatever. It's a DS game. Let's cut it some slack. All right, let's do the. the oh. Okay. All right, we're off. Cool. You don't really get a boost or anything like you do. Whoa, 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 whoa. Chill, chill. Whoa. Okay. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. Okay. All right. We're, we're back on track now. It's not like Mario Kart. I thought because there was a jump option at the beginning, it told me the jump controls. It said, there was a little thing that said I could jump and stuff. Oh. 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 Okay. Okay. So brake turns are a thing. You can, you can still do like a drifty turn thing, but you don't get a boost from it. Um, oh wait, I think you do. That's what the little X thing is, right? They said you had a boost. So I think you build it up if you do the brake drift. Yeah! Yeah, okay. Okay, okay. I'm good at this game. I'm too good at this game. I'm too good at it. I'm, I'm just too good at it. All right, let's go. Let's go, first level of the game. You hear that background music? That's so, oh, it goes so hard. Feel free to screen record. This is really good back. Oh, oh, I nearly, I thought there was a shortcut there. How, how, where are the shortcuts anyways? Like, are there short, there are shortcuts in this game, right? That's a shortcut to my left, or to my right, presumably. Where's the shortcuts? I guess I haven't played this game long enough. <laughs> this is a really fun racing game. Oh, oh, get off the road. Get off the road. Hey, hey, get off the road, boy. Get off the, get off the road. This is my road, my rusties, my radiator springs. If I win this town, then we're gonna turn it into a nuke site. We're gonna absolutely obliterate all of your friends. Yeah, that's what you get for starting a racing tournament that has crashing involved. 
Look what happens. I just run you off the road, you absolute wet white. I bet you shop at Lidl. He looks like someone that would shop at Lidl, doesn't he? I'm not sure what the jump feature's for, really. I don't really seem to be doing much with it. I tried to jump earlier on, and I did like a 360 on top of my head. Oh, maybe for that. Can I jump to get... I don't know. I, I don't really want... Yeah, like, I could probably jump to get there. I don't know. I don't think I'd jump high enough. Yeah, see, I don't really jump that high off the ground. I thought I'd maybe be able to jump, like, at least a bit higher. Seems like it would be quite useful. But, all right, cool. I'll take that. I'll take that. First place. First place. No need no need for the applause. Calm down. Calm down. Calm down. I'll be signing autographs after the show. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Frank first. All right. Easy peasy. Easy win. Easy dub. All right, let's get it. Let's get it. What's next? What's next? Why is... I don't like his eyes. <laughs> it's like he's been tripping on MDMA or something. Look at the way his eyes are, are bugging out. I guess we have to race on him anyway. All right, let's go Mater for this one. Um, <laughs> what is that? That's horrifying. Why do his teeth look like that? Why does he look like Wallace? Oh, I don't know. I don't know. I don't really care. <laughs> I don't care. Why does he look like Wallace, man? It's like he's about to steal my cheese from me. Mater's got a crippling cheese addiction. He's, he's chronically... What is it? Is that chronic addiction? Chronic? I, I don't know. He's addicted to uh, Wensleydale. Something I was always wondered about, to be honest, in the Wallace and Gromit show, like, I love Wallace and Gromit. Like, I, I love it so much, and, and my grandparents used to, to love it, and they used to get me into it and stuff like that. Um, it was actually my grandfather and grandmother that got me into Wallace and Gromit, but it, I always wondered what Wallace's obsession was with cheese. Like, cheese is good, don't get me wrong, cheese is really, really good. But I always wondered, like, what, what's your deal, man? Like, what's your deal? Like, why, why, are you, why have you got such a crippling addiction to cheese like cheese is, is good cheese is fun and i like cheese i think we all like che oh i'm dead all right i'm dead sick we've all got a cheese addiction i think deep down in our hearts somewhere but some of us know how to control it a little bit better than others this man went to space built a rocket ship to go to space with his dog that he didn't know if either, either of them would be able to survive in outside of Earth's atmosphere, and he took them both to space to see if the moon was made out of cheese. This absolute madman thought that the moon was made out of cheese. He built a rocket ship because his addiction was that hard. They ran out of cheese, so they went to the fucking moon instead of just going to their local Aldi. Like, you could have just gone to Aldi, mate. Aldi prices, literally, like, or Sainsbury's, Aldi price match. But why, why don't you go there? You could have gone literally anywhere. Just don't go Waitrose, innit? Like, if you want to go and get, get, get your cheese, you don't have to go to the moon. You can just go elsewhere you know you can just go to a shopping market i don't really know I, I'm, I'm not really i'm, I'm not really a, a, a an expert on it i'm not i haven't really done too much research on where the best places to buy cheese are and i've never really found like a cheese supermarket which would be really cool especially if you're a person like wallace he's a lovely guy but when it comes to cheese you know what i mean he's, he's a cheese freak he knows a bit too much about it he's a bit of a do dodgy bloke taking his dog to the moon uh, a bit scary also, that movie used to terrify me. Do you remember that little robot thing that used to, like, rip Wallace and Gromit's ship apart? That was, like, the original, like, nightmare for me. Like, that was my original nightmare, was just seeing that, that dude, that little robot thing from the top of, um, on top of the moon in Wallace and Gromit, uh, Grand Day Out. I think it was it Grand Day Out, the one where they go to the moon. I forget the actual name of it. Wallace's... <laughs> Wallace's cheese addiction. You kids now, you, you, you probably won't understand that. You're probably not going to understand this at all because you didn't grow up Wallace and Gromit. Or if you did, then more power to you. You've got good family. But if you did grow up with Wallace and Gromit, you know what I'm talking. Alright, let's try not to die this time. We've been talking about Wallace and Gromit too, for too long and how Wallace just has feta cheese pumping through his brain. His brain? His brain? <laughs> I was going to say his veins. But it probably pumps through his brain as well, the amount he talks about it. And to his dog too. Gromit is probably the most sane character in that entire franchise. Like, he can't talk. He's like, bro, I'm a dog. Look at his look at his face. He looks exactly like Wallace. That's what that's why this conversation came up in the first place. Gromit's so sane. I love Gromit so much. He's just he's so confused the entire time. Like why are you talking to me? I'm a dog. I'm a dog. I can't understand English. What what are you doing? I'm just trying to read my magazines. You know as dogs do. Willie's but there's the little there's the the dude again. He was like staring at me. What other maps do we have? There's that piston cup. I guess I can't go there. Yet. Kind of cool. I like the waterfall in the other one. Yeah. I guess we're gonna have to go with this one. Yeah. I'm fine with that. That works for me. Don't mind. Let's go see what homeboy's giving me side eye about. Why is he doing that? Get out of here, bootleg Owen Wilson. What? What's the problem, Sheriff? Speed limit's 25, and I clocked this hot rodder doing 120. That's the problem. 25. I never drive so slow. I'm Otto Van Fastenbottom. Okay. And I'm Lightning McQueen. <laughs> yes, I know. 
Nice to finally meet you. Tell you what, Sheriff. Let me take Otto off your hands. I'll make sure he stays out of trouble. How's three laps sound? Wait, what? No. Like a Sunday drive. I race Le Cars. One race, 24 hours. Uh, Alright. That's a long race. Let's just start with three laps. Come on, Sheriff. Why don't you join us? You can blast your siren. It'll be fun. Distant third. Here I come. Okay. This could this could be like a drunk driver for all you know. He's been doing like what? What did he say? He was doing over the speed limit. I forget the numbers, but he's he's over the speed limit, and uh, and you're rewarding that behaviour by letting him accelerate at maximum speeds around your town. What if he hits a pedestrian? I guess you could argue that there's no pedestrians in the cars universe, but there might be. What if he slams into another car? That's the equivalent to like having a, another person in the cars universe. So what if he does that? Then what? Then you've just then you're just accessory to murder. You hit it. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Whoa, whoa, Sheriff is taught distant third my ass. Distant third my ass, you're coming first. Why is he quicker than the two racing cars? And why is Flo here? Flo wasn't part of this. Would she just tag along and she thought she'd get involved in a legal matter? This is a legal matter. Get out of here. You're not, a, you're not an officer. You don't have a license to be an officer. Get out of it. Get out of here. She's, I'm up her ass. I'm up your ass, Flo. I'm going to be right. I'm going to be all the way up in there. Don't don't you dare think that... I don't know. you better with words, man. I'm not very good with my words. She's like farting and stuff. She's got like dust coming out of her ass. I mean, if she's a car. It's like tires. But like, compared to the other two, why has she got so much dust coming out the back? Oh no, everyone does. My bad. I guess I was just looking at Flo a bit too much. I was just so mesmerized by the fact that she wasn't supposed to be here. So I... It's caught me off guard, really. Alright, let's get those, get those brake turns in. Get ready for the boosts. Turn right to go left, just like Doc said. Just like Doc Hudson said. Oh, I'm pumped. I'm pumped. This sheriff's tripping if he thinks he's beating me. He's tripping if he thinks he's beating me. I haven't lost yet. I haven't lost a single race yet. Get your ass out of here. Get your ass out of here. Fuck. Flo is going to annoy me, man. Get off the racetrack. You're not part of this. It's a legal matter. Wee woo, wee woo. No one invited you here. No one invited you here. Get off the racetrack, man. Thank you. Thank you. What are you doing? Go away! Oh, my God. Yeah! Smack her. It's, um, hmm. it's the, rethink that sentence, James. Rethink that sentence. Smack her off the road. That's better. I like that better. Oh, I can't drift that corner to save my life. I'm so bad at it. So bad at that corner. Flo, go away. She's in the bottom. You can see her in the bottom. She's catching up to me. Also, why is this bridge just falling apart? I get it. It's, it's not like... It's not that deep. But like, why is the bridge just collapsing beneath us? This is not a, a safe place to race. Also, if we do need to end up arresting this guy, what if he's got like 50 petabytes of illegal material on a hard drive in his car? I don't know. Maybe he's got some dodgy stuff in his car. Maybe he's got some dodgy stuff in his phone. And we're just racing him. We pulled him over. You're speeding. Maybe he's on the run. Like, maybe he's a wanted man. Maybe he's an, a wanted felon. And he's on the run. And he's like, I don't know, he's refusing to get a lawyer to represent himself in, in prison or something. They're trying to arrest him. He's got a warrant for his arrest out. And we're just here racing him on an unstable bridge. Our town is getting destroyed because we're putting too much pressure on it. Driving over the bridge at maximum speeds. After this guy. This is a joke, Sheriff. This is an absolute joke. But who do you think you are? You're absolutely dreadful at your job. You're dreadful at your job. Look at this guy. Look at this guy. He's bumping into me. That's assault. That's assault. I'll get you done for assault, mate. That's... I'm, I'm not having that. I'm not having that. That's absolutely disgusting. Alright, I'm, I'm, I've had enough. I'm winning this race now. Third lap. Screw around the corner. Boom. Just like that. And we get the boost. Nice. Oh, it's even out. Even out, bro. Even out. Alright, cool, cool, cool. All right, I like it. I like it. Picasso. All right, let's go. Go. Oh, no, 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 no. I messed up. No, I messed up. Why is the sheriff so fast? I thought you said you were going to come a distant third. You liar. Oh, my God. I'm going to die. No, I'm not. No, I'm not. No, I'm not. I'm fine. I'm fine. I'm fine. Calm down. Calm down. Calm down. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Ah. Uh, uh, come on, man. Come on. Oh, I can do this. I got a boost sword up. I got a boost. Now, go. Yes. Come on. No. Oh. <coughs> 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 
Flo! Flo, get up. Elimination? What does that mean? Do I get to eliminate flow from existing? How do you eliminate people? Alright, I'm being Mater again, because Mater genuinely felt so much better to play than McQueen. Oh, Luigi's here now. Okay. Alright, Mater, you can do this. Let's do this. Same track. It's the same track, I think. I think we picked the same track. It's just not the challenge version. Like, the, the one where you have to race the random other car for some reason. There's, he's probably a wanted felon, and we did nothing about it. Good job. Good job, Sheriff. Absolutely brain dead police department. Completely brain dead police department. I'm gonna make you pay for this, Sheriff. I'm gonna make you pay for this. I'm gonna make sure you get eliminated first. I'm gonna make sure you're eliminated first. Come on, Flo. You and me, we'll get a truce. Luigi, you're on my side, Luigi, right? Like, your name's Luigi, you must be. We're gonna get the Sheriff kicked out of the town. What happens when they're eliminated, by the way, as well? Do they just vanish into the void or something? I won't lie, I really like the map design in this game. If I'm gonna talk on the real for a second, I really like the map design in this game. It controls pretty well as well, like especially if you're using a controller like I am. Uh, I like the dynamic maps. I like that the, the maps have segments that fall apart. I really like, I, I think this is actually quite a good game. This is a lot of fun. I can see how this is like one, this is a perfect DS game. In terms of a DS game, and that's kind of what I'm, that's kind of my mindset right now, uh, is like talking about how good a game is as a DS game. This one is, is pretty high, like this is high ranking um mainly because you know it, it's this is the kind of game you could just pick up and play like you 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 don't really have to do too much it's great it's a lot of fun i don't know how you unlock the other characters though i have no idea how you do that all righty get that boost in sheriff don't you think don't you think i'm done just because i started talking about the game on like a serious level oh how do you get that boost man why is the sheriff so good how do i unlock the sheriff or is it going to be one of those situations? Oh man, I'm so bad at this game, man. Is this going to be one of those situations where when you unlock the boss, they're nowhere near as strong as they were when you faced them? Because that happens a lot in video games. I'm not losing to a corrupt police department. I'm not losing to a corrupt police department, I refuse. I'm not having it, you can eat my dust. It's just you and me now. It's just you and me now. I'm sorry, Luigi, but our truce only had to last for so long. I'm not having this. I'm not having this. Perfect turn, perfect turn. Oh, I hit the side a little bit. I hit the side a little bit. Don't you dare. Don't you dare. Get back behind me. Get behind me. Get in my rear. Get in my rear now. Good boy. Good. Hmm. This is going well. This is going really well. This is going really well. Home stretch. Home stretch, baby. Home stretch. Home stretch. Let's go. Let's go. Let's show this corrupt police department how we do things in Radiator Springs. That rhymes. Drift over the finish line and he's done. He's done. We've done it. Yeah. <laughs> Let's go. Well, that, ladies and gentlemen, was Cars Meta National for the Nintendo DS. This wasn't a review video like my Decepticon ones were. This was just, I'm very bored at 7 p.m. and I want to play a DS game. I might cover this game again. I might even do a full review of it if that's something that you guys would like to see. I wouldn't mind getting good at this game. This is a really captivating game. This had me going. This had my energy going. This had my blood pumping. And not just because I'm on camera. This game had my blood pumping in a way I've never had it pumped before. Maybe uh, it's just a problem I should see a doctor about. But I think it's mostly brought on by Cosme International. Uh, this video was also a lot uh, quicker and easier to make than the uh, fully fledged full length Transformers Decepticons reviews uh, or any DS game review or any game review whatever uh, mainly because I'm just playing it right here and giving my opinion on it so if this is something that you would want to see again in future hopefully when I have a chance to shave because this is this is this is blasphemous this is awful then do let me know uh, i would love to make this kind of video again anyways that is the end of today's video thank you so much for sticking around i'm gonna go calm down and uh maybe take a nap and i'll catch you all in the next one have a great evening everybody bye bye <laughs>